Hospital Credit Union. We are just nine days into December and the average temperature is running one degree above normal, making it the 47th warmest December on record. And it's going to stay warm. Here's a look at the next seven days. Our normal high is now 33 degrees. I'm forecasting high temperatures to be above that as we head through the weekend and all of next week. Most days will feature high temperatures in the mid to upper 30s. Today we had lower to mid 30s with cloudy skies. There may have been a couple of snowflakes out there or a little bit of drizzle, but for the most part, all the steadier precipitation stayed way to our south, and you can see that snow continues to pull away from the area this evening. We did have a winter weather advisory up earlier today for part of the viewing area, Green Lake County and Marquette County, but those advisories have been dropped. And you can see here on the winter weather reports map that the snow did stay south of the NBC 26 viewing area. This line right here is the divider between the NBC 26 viewing area and the Milwaukee and Madison viewing areas. And you can see that for the most part, all the snow was across southern Wisconsin down into northern Illinois. Now here in northeast Wisconsin, specifically the Fox Valley, we have picked up three inches of snow so far this winter. We really have nothing to show for it on the ground. Normally we would have picked up between six and seven inches. And last winter we had picked up nearly 13 inches of snow by this time. We're not going to see any more snow tonight. The high res future radar shows dry conditions working in from the west. Today's main weather maker, an area of low pressure passing to our south. But this next system here across South Dakota is going to move across the area tomorrow and it'll give us a chance for a light wintry mix or some snow. You can see that here on your day planner for Saturday. That chance for some snow with high temperatures in the mid 30s. Skycast shows that snow developing across central Wisconsin during the morning and then spreading east during the late afternoon and evening. A little bit of a wintry mix is possible where it stays all snow, especially across the northern half of the viewing area. A dusting to around an inch is possible. Most of us probably seeing a dusting to a half an inch, but an inch or so is not out of the question, especially north and west of Green Bay. Right now we have only picked up a trace of snow here in the Fox Valley this December, which puts us on pace for the least snowy December on record, which occurred back in 1943. I don't think that's going to happen. We've got two weeks uh, until Christmas, and I think we're going to see snow between now and then, which means I'm also thinking we're not going to have our fifth brown Christmas in a row. We've had four in a row, and uh, I know most of you probably do not want to see number five in a row but we'll have to wait and see. It doesn't look that way right now. So tonight, cloudy skies, overnight lows around 30. Tomorrow, some light snow or a wintry mix. Highs will be in the mid 30s. Once again, some minor accumulations are possible, especially across the northern half of the viewing area. My three degree guarantee for tomorrow is 36. If I can hit that high within three degrees, we will donate $100 to St. Joseph Food Program. And we did that yesterday. I forecast 35. The actual high temperature was 36 degrees. 36 on Sunday, mostly cloudy, sun and clouds Monday. And then a bigger system rolls through Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday. And that system does have the chance to produce some accumulating snow across the area. Now sports with Brandon Kennard. Ripon College is the only school in its conference without an on-campus football field.